African Creation Energy, creative solution-based technical consulting presents How to Build a Z-Pillar Battery, an experiment from the book TAR Technology, Engineering Applications of African Sciences, available at www.africancreationenergy.com. The Z-Pillar is an ancient African symbol which represents stability. The Z-pillar is shown as a column with four parallel horizontal bars across the top. The Z-pillar was associated with the African creation deity Zutar, who was called the Noble Z. The Z-pillar was considered the backbone of the Egyptian deity Osiris and was raised during certain ceremonies as a symbol of potency or power and the resurrection of Osiris. The Z pillar along with the Ankh and Wasp are often found depicted connected as a circuit in the star held by the African creation deity Tar. The Z pillar as a symbol of stability can be constructed as a source of constant or stable DC voltage, much like a battery. In fact, the Z pillar symbol is currently used as a symbol for DC voltage sources in electrical circuit diagrams and schematic. There are also several depictions of the Z-pillar as what appears to be a source of electricity and energy found in Egypt. In the book entitled The Ankh, African Origin of Electromagnetism, the writer Nur Ankh Amun describes how Alexandro Volta acquired knowledge of how to come up with the voltaic pile battery after discovering a Z-pillar battery while pillaging and invading African Egyptian relics. He states, in 1798, Napoleon recruited 167 scientists and technicians to accompany the French fleet in the conquest of Egypt, and in 1801, Volta, the so-called discoverer of the PAR battery, was given a medal and a pension by Napoleon for his contribution. Volta's discovery of the principles by which the Z produced a stable electrical current is considered to be the greatest invention of the 19th century. The construction of a Z pillar as a power battery DC voltage source involves the separation of two different metals by an electrolyte, creating a volt or space, where there is a potential difference enabling the flow of electrical charge. Coincidentally, the Italian physicist Alexandre Volta, who was said to have discovered voltage, and whose name is said to be the source of the volt, unit of measurement, is phonetically similar to the volt caused by separation that creates potential difference and enables the flow of electric charge. An electrochemical cell will correspond to a single horizontal bar on the Z-pillar and piling or stacking four electrochemical cells will construct a Z-pillar power battery as commonly depicted on the walls of the various buildings found throughout Africa. Piling, stacking or connecting the electrochemical cells in series increases the voltage across the overall component and therefore the voltage of the Z-pillar pile battery can be increased by piling more electrochemical cells. To build a Z-pillar pile battery you will need 4 pennies or 4 round pieces of copper, 4 nickels or 4 round pieces of zinc coated metal. 4 cotton rounds, electric tape, salt, vinegar, 1 LED lighting emitting diode, voltmeter, measuring cup and a small bowl. To begin, choose an appropriate base for your Z-pillar battery. For this experiment, we used a rook chest piece and also moulded a base out of clay. Use the electric tape to attach one small wire onto a nickel or zinc disc and place it onto your bank. Mix one quarter cup of vinegar and one teaspoon of salt in a small bowl to make an electrolyte. Dip and soak the cotton in the salt and vinegar solution, squeeze out the excess and place on top of your nickel or your zinc dip. Place one penny or copper disc on top of the cotton to form the electrochemical cell. Place your next nickel or zinc disc 
on top of the penny or the copper bit. Then place another piece of cotton on top of it. And then place another penny or copper bit on top of the cotton to form another electrochemical cell. Repeat this process using all four nickel or zinc discs and all four pennies or copper discs to create four electrochemical cells for the Z-pin battery. Test the voltage at the top penny and bottom nickel. Connect the LED using wire to the top penny and bottom nickel and see the Z pillar power battery produce light. For more information and other African science experiments, be sure to check out the book TAR Technology, the engineering applications of African sciences, available at www.africancreationenergy.com.